we are going to start with what is the difference between must data and transaction data right so this question is frequently asked with the freshers okay so whoever is the freshers over here this question is going to be very very important for the freshers who is having one or two year of three years of experience like that so what is master data right what is master data and what is transaction data can you write in one word your answer over here what is master data and what is transaction data in one word you have to write your answer so just write in the chat box what is master data and transaction data your thought on the master data and transaction data be interactive right over here okay so master data changed rarely right master data it changes very rarely very good very good and transaction data talk about the transaction data transaction data changes frequently very good so you all know very well you your concept is good about the master data and transaction data so master data changes very rarely transaction data it changes very frequently for the master data we are having the examples like you know a student id the table which we have created in the ABAP class, right? Then the address, employee, master data, address, data. Then here in the transaction data, which is going to be changed on the regular basis, like purchase order, right? It keeps on updating with the items. If some future purchase order is going to come into the picture, then the existing purchase order with some extra line items is going to be changed, right? So purchase order, sales order price so these all are the transaction 